This queen used to make men duel to death before sleeping with the winner. Her name was Nzinga, and she was a total power freak. She ruled Angola in the 1600s, and she did not like being referred to as queen. She was a king to her people, and she even ruled dressed as a man. It was a way for Nzinga to feel powerful by reversing gender roles. She was famous for keeping a large harem of young men known as male wives. There were a whopping 80 of these men in her harem, and they were only allowed to wear dresses and function as women in the palace. At night time, she would randomly pick two of her wives and make them engage in a brutal fight to the death. The winner was rewarded with spending only a single night with her, as no one ever slept with her twice in the morning. The victor would also get killed, and she would start all over again. You'd be surprised, but she only disbanded the harem after turning 75 years old, upon which she married the youngest member, a boy young enough to be her child. Follow for more historical tales.